I'll be demonstrating how to use tinting. Start by creating a new mesh with the block tool. Find and apply a tintable material. You can use any material, but the ones that are labelled as tintable are designed so that some parts will not change colour when tinted. In this example, the rust is not affected by the tint. Press Alt-Enter to open the mesh's object properties. Go to Colour and open the colour picker to change the tint. Tints are applied to the entire mesh. If you want one face to have a different tint to the rest of the mesh, go to Face Mode, select the face you want to change and press Alt-N. This separates the selected face into a different mesh. Return to Object Mode and press Alt-Enter to open the new mesh's properties and change the colour. Tinting also works on props, and some props such as the card scanner have special tintable materials. With this you can bring colour and vibrance into your level.